All right, it's Shane L. Fucking Y here. I got some shit to get off my fucking chest right now. Start off, JR, I caught your stream today. Man, listen, bro, I got your fucking back. I've deleted his fucking comments. You gotta understand, man. More you react to it, the more he's gonna feed off of it. I've had run-ins with the exact same fucking dudes, buddy. Months ago, you could go back in the drunk news fucking chat logs on their videos. You know what, man? The more I reacted is what these people want. And the fact is, dude, entertainment business in fucking general, man, you're going to deal with tr haters, trolls. Look at Pug1. You go on his message boards. And I've been public about his shit, too. It's fucking, it's nothing but haters. If you want to be on this limelight, this camera and shit, you're going to have to deal with haters. I've had to fucking learn with that. Look at the shit I deal with on Swearnet from people that we fuck, I end up on live streams with all the fucking time, buddy. Like, like, I don't, I didn't have your back. I didn't laugh about the situation last night. Fucking what I saw you chat. For the most part, I was playing fucking Xbox. I'm not even paying attention to what's going on in the chat logs or YouTube. And then, buddy, this is where I got to get at because now this is my point and why I fucking started a video. You think you're the only one that's kind of been put in a fucking shitty fucking positions you don't want to fucking be in, man? Look at me on those live streams. Last night, I was put in position on live on camera. People asking my pers uh, permission if it's okay for a certain individual to fucking come on chat. And everybody's stopping and pausing and making a deal. Do you not think that puts me on the fucking spot horribly? Especially, do you not make me, do you not see the position I'm in where I'm feeling like, okay, if I say no, then everybody on the panel is going to think I'm an asshole? So, dude, like, fuck, man, you're not the only one. And this is now where I'm fucking at. Guys, Jokerfish and whoever else, you guys know I've been barely into, my heart's not been into these fucking live streams anymore. I got a lot going on in my plate. I got a fucking grandmother. It's on her fucking deathbed right now. Her fucking goddamn, she fucking just went through chemo treatment. I had to go fucking visit her today. And then it's fucking getting to me. And then it's like, when I say I'm not into these live streams, stop fucking, like, guys, all of you guys, stop from harassing me about it. And then it's like, fuck, man. Like, and then the fact is, and then it's just like, bring on people that I have no interest for that have no interest for me or people I'm going to end up with fucking conflicts or but then 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 just yesterday just to be put on the fucking spot live on camera not off camera not a private message live on camera so I'm looking like an asshole if I answer this fucking question the wrong fucking way live on camera so I'm put on the fucking spot like it's just but the, if I should bring this like is it okay to bring this guy on and that guy on I've, and then, see, this is now brings me to my point with JR. J JR, I love you too, buddy. I love you and Jokerfish. But at the same time, man, but the shit you're going through, I'm going through the fucking exact same. And I think, I don't want to compare mine's worse, yours worse, or whatever. But I mean, I was put on fucking spot on my fucking camera, buddy. Like, that's, to, to have somebody I don't agree with morally and all those things kind of like your beef with this certain individual but well, you not find that a lot difficult a pretty difficult situation too man so don't just sit there and act like fuck man you're going through it yourself i'm going through it too i'm fucking chatting with a lot of guys that fucking bust my nuts and swear at all the time you've been on swear at you've seen half those fucking guys and when the shit they said to me on fucking swear at man so it's like fuck i know where you're coming from and yeah, I know, he's fucking relentless. Don't get me wrong. And I have, like I said, I've had fucking words. I try to stop him. Don't think I don't fucking have your back. Don't fucking accuse me of those fucking things, man. I am fucking like... And again, and now this brings me up to another point. And other people, when you host live streams, and I say I'm not interested, I'm not feeling it, don't give me the, oh, come on, I need you here and stuff. Who, where was anybody from my fucking live stream two weeks ago? I was stuck with Alonzo, not like, oh, thank you for Alonzo showing up, but he's not much of a talker. We're two different personalities and stuff like that. It's a lot different stream. He's not one of the usual guys I talk to, so it's a lot harder for me and him to play off each other. I saw a lot of you guys in the fucking chat room. You guys wanted to fucking chat on YouTube. Nobody was there to back me up. 
So, you know, it's like, why the fuck do I even want to fucking show up to anybody's fucking live streams anymore? That's kind of fucking shit that's going to happen in my own fucking personal live stream. And that, that doesn't, it's not even the fact. It's just, I've got a lot going on. i got a lot of, i got three grand, grandparents. My last three grandparents have all been fucked up this year and all in the short time. Besides a lot of other fucking headache, drama, and stress. So it's like, you know what? I don't need this internet bullshit. I don't need this fucking internet drama. I don't need people crying to me about fucking things. And then at the same time, I don't need people putting me on the spot, especially live on camera, about things, okay? So it's like, you know what, man? And I've seen a lot of fucking guys crying lately. A lot. I've seen beef between Josh and fucking Dean now. And that's getting escalated. Um... We all know about the fucking little goofling man that likes to fucking appear here or there. Right. And then there's just all these other random motherfuckers lately. So, f whatever. You know what? So, just guys, don't expect me around much anymore. That's all I got. Yeah. All right.